So let's look at the five different ways that you can repurpose your podcast into video. Number one is to video record yourself whilst you're recording your podcast episode. So this is a really great idea because it's quite a high engagement video. It's quite highly engaging because people can see you and they can see you, you know, moving and talking and um, get to know you a little bit better. You don't need fancy equipment to do this. You really can just use the camera on your smartphone. For me, my iPhone camera is way better than any camera I've ever bought and it's brilliant for video recording. Um, You need to think about creating a space. It doesn't need to be anything fancy. Number two is for those of you who do podcast interviews with guests. And the idea is to record that. So video record the interview. So if you do your podcast interview over Skype, then there are a couple of ways that you can do this. Well, basically, if you have a Mac, then you can download some screen recording tools that will record that video conversation in the Skype call. So one that I use is called Ecamm. So you can go to ecamm.com. It's called the Ecamm Call Recorder. Um, I think there's a short free trial and then it's only about $29 or so to purchase it. And if you have a PC, a Microsoft PC, you can use Skype with something called Pamela. Now, another option which still puts you on video, but not quite the same focus, so you're not the focal point, is to screen record. So you can use different software for this. For PC, you can use Camtasia. And for Mac, you can use ScreenFlow. But what you can do is if you have a webcam on your computer, you can screen record what's going on on your screen. And it will also be recording by webcam you and it will overlay the little webcam image somewhere on the uh, on the screen basically so you won't be the focus you'll just you'll appear just as a, as a smaller video image so number 4 is where you take the audio from your podcast and you create images and then you pair them together and create a video so you can do this for the whole podcast episode and you can it can be one image or it can be many images um, it could perhaps be changing images as the um you know the context of the podcast changes But you use a software like in Mac, I use iMovie, but use a a movie software and you bring over your audio. You perhaps create some images in, say, for example, Canva or PicMonkey and you bring them into and then you kind of pair them up together and create a video. Now, as I mentioned, you could do this for the whole podcast episode or what you could do, which is what at Content 10X we do with our clients, is you can create a really slim down short video, which we call a trailer. Okay, and lastly, number five is to just take the whole audio from your podcast episode and put that onto YouTube or onto Facebook. So some hosts, some podcast audio hosts, for example, Libsyn in particular, I know, allow you to set this up automatically. 